Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you so much for your great support always. I'm so grateful for your continued support to this channel. Thank you so much, ladies and gentlemen. Now, Kenyans, as you speak, Kenyans have successfully filed a case against William Ruto at the ICC, International Criminal Court. Remember, the allegations are that William Ruto is not considering to stop the abductions and killings across the Republic of Kenya. Number two, William Samuel Ruto is a dictator, a man who cannot leave any Kenyan to come out to give his or her own opinion as per the constitution that gives us freedom of expression. The man has come out to approve that he don't care about the interest of Kenyans at all. Another thing, they are coming out to demand that William Samuel Ruto killed Kenyans during the Gen Z demonstration and no one is speaking about compensating them and, of course, a government who can account the lives of Kenyans. In other words, we are like not humans in this Republic of Kenya. So main, the main issue here is those who are killed during the demonstration of Gen Z's. Number two, the abductions and killings in this Republic of Kenya. And number three, how William Ruto is handling Kenyans, not as if we are human. Ladies and gentlemen, I want you to watch this video coming from Hague, ICC, International Criminal Court. But before we watch, as you always do, ensure you like the video. When you like the video, you automatically support the work that I'm doing in this channel because sometimes you watch the video and you forget liking the video. So this is just a reminder. As you watch, ensure you like the video. Let us watch. Tell me. Right. Uh, a very good uh, afternoon, my fellow Kenyans. Uh, we are here at The Hague in the Netherlands. My name is Dr. Mkenny, a human rights activist. Uh, we came here at the ICCJ, the, um, the, the International Criminal Court for Justice. We came here specifically to bring the Kenyan government, the government led by the corrupt ruler named William Samoy Kipchichil Arab Ruto. We arrived here at The Hague today um, after uh, some few legal uh, advisors. Uh, I think we have been referred to the ICC rather than the ICCJ. Uh, my fellow Kenyans, I, I come to you again. This is Dr. Amken here speaking. We will be calling for a, a, a demonstration here in The Hague, a peaceful demonstration, as soon as we have um, a, a correct information or rather legal advice from our legal team. My legal team are here with me at the very most moment, uh, but we have been referred, as I've said, to the ICC. My fellow Kenyans, all Kenyans, Kenyans in the Holland, Kenyans in, the, in, um, in Europe, Kenyans all over the world. As soon as we have it right, we will call you and we will need your support. We will need your support because the president of Kenya, Mr. William Samoy Ruto, is going the, the wrong way. Too much abduction too much killing, boys, boys and girls have been killed during demonstration, people have gone missing in the, in, in the Kenyan government, the, the, the president of Kenya has taken um, uh, drug dealers such as Hassan Ali Joho, put them into the cabinet and uh, turned him into ministers. These people, Hassan Ali Joho and his team, they're all needed in New York because of the Akasha um, 
and uh, they, they are cashier drug dealers. They are, they are cashier drug dealers at the moment have already been jailed in New York. They've been jailed for 25 years. And yet, the Minister for Mining in Kenya is still yeah. running on the loose. Once again, we came to the head. We are insisting that President William Samuel Ruto must resign. He must resign because he's going round and round, killing innocent boys and girls. There is no human rights in Kenya. Abduction is at the highest rate. And because of this, we are asking the President of Kenya, the William Samoy Kipchurchir Arab Ruto must resign, must resign. Boys and girls, men and women, all Kenyans in Europe, in Netherlands, we will come back to you once again and we will tell you once we've had the legal advice from the legal team when will be the demonstration led. Please Kenyans, contact Dr. Amkeni and you will get all the details on my uh, uh, internet, on my TikTok account, on my YouTube account. We will have, you will have all the information on when the demonstration will be led. Thank you very much. We are very thankful to the, uh, no, uh, to the uh, uh, Holland government, the Netherlands government. We are very thankful to the um, ICCJ team here. We've been received in, in the highest respect ever, and we are very thankful for their help. And because of this, we will let you know further down the line. Mr. William Samuel Ruto and your team, the ruler of the Republic of Kenya must resign, must go. Thank you very much. Thank you all. God bless you all. Thank you. This is Dr. Mkeni here speaking. Now, Kenyans, if I may ask a simple question, is there possibility of William Ruto being summoned to go and answer such kind of allegations? Because now this is beyond our expectations. The man promised to come out and compensate those who were killed, brutalized by police officers. No one is speaking about compensating them. In other words, we as Ken Kenyans, we are like animals. You can be killed, no one will speak about it. In other countries, a human being cannot be killed the way we are being killed Kenyans. If you saw the story of Shaka Hola, you cannot believe, and we are having National Intelligence Service. The way people were killed and dumped at quarry, and still we are having National Intelligence Service, NIS. People are being abducted, killed, thrown in River Yala. As I can remember, the director of Wells Fargo, Director Ayeko, who was killed and found at River Yala, and several others. In other words, they don't care about our lives. Is there a possibility of William Ruto being summoned to come out and answer how he don't care about Kenyans at all? That is my worries. Is there a possibility? Because now the case that has been filed at ICC we are just waiting how things are going to be because it is Kenyans who have come out to file this case about Kenyans being killed, abducted, with no answers. What do you think? Drop your opinion at the comment section below. Otherwise, thank you so much because of your great support. Please consider subscribing, liking, commenting, and sharing this video. Bye-bye till you meet in another video.